Hi, I'm Craig Sigal, the Mental Toughness Trainer, and I had the opportunity to interview Coach Mendo, who runs Quick Handle Basketball Training. In this short clip, he shares how he sparks motivation in youth athletes. My philosophy is, is that up through the eighth grade, you need to steer them. Because generally speaking, kids do not understand what a discipline, being disciplined is, being organized is, being goal oriented is, they don't, uh, they, they don't understand that. So it's easy for them to bounce, oh I like this, I like that, but they don't know what it's going to take to be great at that, right? My oldest daughter was in t-ball and the rule was you don't keep score, right? So the kids are playing, and, you know, it's just, you know, you're just trying to develop skills and all that stuff. But who was keeping score on the sideline? The parents were. And, and it was weird, it was like astonishing to me. And I was like, no, what you do is you keep score and you teach your kids how to deal with it all as early as you possibly can. Look at you lost the game, you're okay, you're, you're, you're a winner, you're okay. You, did you give 110%? You're okay, you're good, let's go get a Slurpee. And I'll tell you a supreme example. They were either in the finals of a, of a tournament or semifinals or something. And so she was crying. Mom was upset, everybody was upset, ankle was out, she was done, she was toast. And so the new game was starting to get ready to warm up and I said, Jess, let's go, man, you're gonna play, aren't you? She goes, Dad, I can't. I go, no, no, let's get up on the table. And of course, mom was looking at me like, you are in so much trouble. I go, no, she's gonna play. I go, we'll, we'll tape her up. You, you have pre-wrap? You have tape? And she's, she started to cry, right? I go, Jess, man, your team needs you, man. Are you gonna step up to the challenge? What are you gonna do about this? And I got all the pre-wrap on. Started getting the stirrups, started doing the figure eights. Got the whole thing, I, and she's just going, I go, you can do this. You're a winner, your team needs you out there. You can manage this. Hey man, I've been through a lot of injuries. You gotta be tough right now, you gotta play through this, you gotta do all this stuff. She's like, you can start to see the courage come in here. The courage come in, she's like, all right dad, if this is what it takes to be great, I'm gonna do it. I said, it's like, and you know, just getting the dirty looks and stuff. I, I knew the plan I had. Finished taping her, tied her up. She's just like that. And so she came off the table, focused, ready to run out there. She stepped, I picked her back up, set her back on the table. I said, that's what I wanted right there. Nice. And everybody looked and they were like, and I, and I looked right at my wife, I go, you gotta trust the old man. <laughs> and that was a lesson for her. Yeah. It wasn't whether you did it or not, but were you willing to do it? Cut that tape off of her, and that, that, my daughter has played through so many injuries. She has been a warrior out on the court. And I'm not saying it was just because of this experience. Yeah. But, if, but if you just bail your kids out over and over again, and they don't learn how to work through the rough waters of life, I'm telling you. So did you like that? We've got a lot more mental game tips and strategies for youth athletes. Get on our training series list by entering your email in the sign-up box at teenmentaltoughness.com. And just to get you started, you'll get my guided visualization, Master the Pressure, and an ebook, How to Be a Great Sports Parent. Go to teenmentaltoughness.com now.